I'm here with Mike and Doug from Awkward Family Photos. Hi guys, how are you doing? Hi, thank you for having us. Cool. We're good. Good. So when did you start the blog? We started the blog almost a year today, right? I started with a photo hanging in my parents' house. It's very awkward. And then Doug and I went to lunch shortly after I saw the photo. Mm -hmm. We started talking about it. He said, I have a ton of these type of photos and it kind of took off from there. What do you think is the appeal of these awkward blogs and why are they so successful in the online space? There's something relatable about it. Everybody has a family and everybody has had awkward moments with their family. But in general, I think a lot of these blogs, people see something in them that they, that they, that they have themselves and they want to share. What are some of your favorites of these types of blogs? So we're both big fans of Cake Rex, mm -hmm. Bar Mitzvah Disco, Sexy Executives, a really funny site. You have a more appealing, self-deprecating voice than some of the blogs. We really wanted it to be a friendly place ultimately mm -hmm. so that people would feel comfortable because we are asking people to give us their family photos. So yeah. if, if, if we get a family photo and we just destroy it, nobody else is going to send us anything. Yes. So um, it's important to us that the tone of the site is... Um, family friendly. It's yes. funny, but, but, <laughs> but funny, but obviously... I mean, we push it a little bit sometimes, but we try never to be mean. And what are your opinions on blogs to books and this mainstream way of presenting online media. In our case, it made sense to sort of make this ultimate family photo album, because mm -hmm. albums are what we all used to know. We put a lot of photos aside that we were getting that we loved, but mm -hmm. we didn't put them on the site, we saved them for the book. I think if, if it feels like there's more to see in, in a book, if there's more to delve into, like for, for us it was, it was getting more what's awkward about family, not just the photos, but the stories and mm -hmm. how these photos came about. Then I think the transition to a book or more traditional media, it makes a lot of sense. Thank you for talking to us today. It was good to meet you both. Thank, Thank you. you. You can check out their website at awkwardfamilyphotos.com.